Hey guys, good afternoon. I was gonna say good morning then. Um, so we're on our way to. It's never morning, it's it is. Excuse me. The last two days I've been up in the morning and you've been in bed sleeping. So don't talk to be, me yesterday. about being an early riser, boy. So on our way to my mum's, um, and from there we're going to a fancy dress. 21st um, and Tom and I are dressed originally I, I got confused which house Cho is in and after Tom said that she's in Ravenclaw I, was like, oh, I don't even watch Harry Potter and I knew that it was our was friend that told him no. don't you try and make it out like you know what house she's in anyway I got confused I was thinking about Cedric and Cho because Cedric's in Hufflepuff so then I was like oh Harry and Cho were like kind of like a thing at one point so I don't know I for some reason I had in my head that she was Hufflepuff so I was like oh you can go as Harry I'll go as Cho anyway now and then it was a switch up between whether I was going to wear the classic robes as well as like Tom or if I would wear like my, what I would presume to be modern day Hufflepuff wear which is like the jacket I've got on now which I will show you fully at some point probably when we get to mum's um, but anyway, in the end, we decided to go for modern day wear, both of us. So, Tom's got it. Again, I'll show you when we get there. Bomber jacket, same. It's not the same bomber jacket, but it's a bomber jacket to match mine. Um, a white shirt, and then we've both got the ties on. And then we're just wearing black jeans and black vans with it. And then on the back of this jacket, it has like a badger from the Hufflepuff house. And then for wands, I went with Newt's because it's probably my favorite wand. Obviously, he's a Hufflepuff. And then this wand is Tom's, and this is from Orlando, so it doesn't belong to anyone, so it could be any house. Because um, the only other wand I've got besides those two is Harry's, and obviously, he's a Gryffindor. So, anyway, enough to that. I will vlog when I get to Mum's, and I'll show you everyone's outfits um, as well as ours. The, the theme was I iconic couples, but it doesn't necessarily have to be a super well known couple or anything. So, a Hufflepuff couple it is. Oh, she doesn't love you. Right, stand up then. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I'm me. <laughs> right, show everyone your outfit. Do a twirl. Get your wand. <laughs> if that was me, you know my ankle would have come out. <laughs> You should have seen us yesterday, guys. We were marking out what we want our garden to be. And Tom's like, go on, take a step on the stepping stone. I went to go take a step. Fake stepping stone, which was actually just sand. <laughs> yeah, it's just sand. Obviously, I don't walk on sand well. So I literally took like one step and my ankle was like that. Uh, anyway, is that my wand? Oh no, it's yours. We got matching black fans. You should have worn my pop, pop socks so we could have matched. My ankles get cold. Never mind your ankles. Bomber jacket, Hufflepuff tie. This is what a modern day wizard would look like. You gotta stick it up your nose, get troll bogeys on it. Harry Potter fans, you all know that reference? <laughs> okay, now it's my turn. Hold the camera. Ones that they're ready. Disarm only! What's the spell? No, I have to say the spell. Yeah. Let me drop it. You have to say it if you want me to disarm my wand. Eh. Say it. Here we go, wandy droppy. <laughs> <laughs> it's alright? Not even close. Ready? Spilling arms! Does that mean drop it? Yes! I don't want to drop it on the floor because it could break you just here. Dropped it two seconds ago. I know, and then I picked it up and it's in okay. fragile. Outfit then. Avabra <laughs> Cadabra. Is that the death one? Matching tops. No? It's Avada Kedavra. Oh, was close. I think. Something like that. I used to think it was Avada Kedavra. Oh. Anyway, we'll show my outfit. Tie, matching white tops, black jeans, black bands, and this is my Hufflepuff, Hufflepuff jacket that I was talking about in the car. Hufflepuff, and then. Can they see it? Yes. The badger. The badger. Badger, 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 badger. <laughs> when I went to Japan. Troll bogeys. Oh! No! Tickle your brain. Get away. Don't wipe it on me. Give me that. I wanted to show you guys quickly. 
before everyone gets here. Please not taking a bullet potato off his shit. <laughs> hey guys, so we're home now. I didn't film as much as I would have liked at the fancy dress party, but eh, it is. What can I do about it now? I might have some footage like from Snapchat and stuff like that. So if I do, I'll, I would have put that in or I'll put it in now if I haven't. Um, and yeah, basically I am absolutely exhausted. I did so much running around yesterday and today. I had loads of stuff that I needed to do. At some point I do want to do an updated house tour, but not at the moment because it's just crazy. The moment. Like, let me just show you, right? I'm sat in the garage at the moment. And look at that mountain of cardboard. My car is parked in the garage, but there's still like so much stuff like bricks and my wheelchair bins and all cardboard. Like, all this was cardboard. Um but we got rid Tom got rid of it I think last weekend or the weekend before. So I've been parking my car in the garage since then. But there's still so much stuff everywhere. We've mostly done like we've mostly completed the theatre room, our bedroom, the living area, one of the bedrooms, kinda, the computer room, and then the other bedroom, because there's four bedrooms, the master room, and then there's three other ones. One of them we turned into a study. The other one is the guest bedroom at the moment and then the other one is a bedroom but we don't have a bed or anything in it and at the moment it's just full of boxes that we still haven't unpacked and whatnot. So like I said at some point I will do a updated house tour and show you guys around and what we've done so far. So excited for that so hopefully that will be in the next couple of weeks or next month or whatever. <sighs> My breath. My grandparents are leaving next Thursday um they've been here since January and they were meant to go home in like March um and then obviously the whole corona thing happened and then they were meant to be going in April then it was June now it's July it was meant to be the 4th of July and then it got moved to the 16th which is next Thursday so I'm really really sad that they're leaving so I've been spending a lot of time with them and probably will be in the next week um yeah i am so tired so i'm gonna end this vlog here guys i really really hope you enjoyed it might vlog tomorrow i'll see how i feel or i might carry this vlog on tomorrow we shall see but yeah i love you guys so so much if you did enjoy this vlog please do give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and i'm hopefully gonna get back into the swing of vlogging um maybe not every day i'm gonna try and just do once a week or film a week and film little bits each day and make it one vlog um, so let me know which you'd prefer, whether you'd just prefer, prefer me to vlog one day like I did today or if you'd prefer me to vlog like Monday to Friday and then edit it and then upload it on the weekend or the following Monday or however it works. I don't know. Let me know in the comments. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video.